Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. This is the next 24 hours love and general situation she's reading for you Taurus. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine. I hope you're safe wherever you are right now. This reading is for you. What can I get for Taurus please? What is the love reading and general situation reading for the Taurus friends out there? What is the message for you, okay? Before I start, Taurus, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for your support. Guest viewers, if you haven't, click the subscribe button in the bell. Please do it now if you are interested and if you are keen. And if you would like to further support my channel, check out the description box below because in there, you'll find the details of my Instagram account. And also, Taurus, if you would like to avail of other services that I offer outside of the YouTube platform, go to my website. It is www.sunshine-tv.com. In there, you will see the manifestation items, the astrolo astrology chart that we will be introducing very soon, and um, private reading. It always comes free for, you know, for every purchase of the manifestation item and the vlog, okay? So this is for you, Taurus. What can I get for Taurus? What is the general and love energy for Taurus in the next one for hours? What is ready for you to know and meant for you to know? This is for Taurus, okay? So let's start your reading. You've got here the Two of Pentacles in upright position, the Nine of Wands, the Queen of Cups. There is a female. There's a female person who you're trying to impress, you're trying to please them. And... They're, they're not interested with you or they're so busy to give you an attention. But I really feel like um, there's a female. There's a female that you're trying to improve your relationship with them. You're trying to get their attention. You're trying to please them, impress them. I think this person is busy. I mean, no offense, they're quite busy. It's nothing. It has nothing to do with you. Um, I'm really getting like they are aware that you're trying to get their attention because this is you. You're giving your pentacles to them. You want this. You want that. And yeah, I really feel like, you know, you idolize this for some of you guys. This is like your coach, your mentor. They're quite busy. Nine of Wands, the Queen of, the Queen of Cups. If you see their schedule, they're quite busy. But there would come a time that they would have a sit down with you. And you will get that time with them. I don't know. This could be a personal coach. Um, but they have an important play in your next um, in your next two to nine weeks. I think it's connected to a career or it's connected to a household situation. But it's a female. Okay. Uh, it's a female. It, the main message in here is that don't take it personally it's not that they don't like you it's more of they're just busy okay but they will have a time for you so you just wait you're like in the queue of the things or the person that they need to work on or they need to to talk to but they'll come towards you and schedule some time they will spend they will find time for you because i feel like you are in the waiting waiting game for this person to be available and they will it might take a bit of time but you are in their mind you are in their agenda and they know they notice your effort okay your your effort is acknowledged your effort towards them it's noted all right and then the second reading is you've got the six of pentacles the six of wands the two of cups <laughs> so you tried with love okay I really feel like in the in the three to six weeks from now, three to six weeks from now, let's say 12 weeks, 12 weeks, you know. Let's say you're not lucky when it comes to love in the next 12 weeks. But I tell you, you will be lucky in your career. Something great is going to happen in your career. Like this is a game changer, okay? So if love is not working in your realm, realm in your world um if it's not working in your world i tell you if you focus on a project a business an improvement about your physical appearance a business a career within 
6 to 12 weeks from now, something big is up for you. Something quite extraordinary. It's like a jackpot. If it's a career, good paying money. And then maybe a managerial role. But like easy PC, you know, if once you switch your focus into a career or improvement or business, it will come so quickly. You know, the universe will support you in that. It's like a reading when love doesn't work, invest in yourself. If you invest into yourself, that will include career, uh, that will include, you know, physical improvement and really get, getting like physical improvement. You might take a cycling class or like biking and it will really drop the weight, like you will look gorgeous. So this is amazing. If If things are not working in the love department, convert the energy to career or physical improvement and oh my god this is amazing it is it's worth it whatever this is that your your intuition is telling you go for it okay and then the next reading is you've got the two of wands the hierophant hierophant <laughs> sorry hierophant i'm struggling with r <laughs> and then two of wands the hierophant and the two of swords um take it easy um you've got the two of wands don't plan you avoid planning um itinerary or something to do with future planning i mean it's in march and i think you're already planning for the rest of the year things will change so do not commit Avoid committing on a very long-term plan when it comes to a subject matter or a situationship where you think it would change. For example, travel. You're planning your travel or the places you want to visit. And you know for a fact that if you plan and if you buy the ticket, it could really, really change because of pandemic. So, two of swords. Yeah, I really feel like two of swords, two of wands. Maybe plan for now, plan the next two months. But don't go further on that because it might change. And you might not get the reimbursement, you know. So commit only for the next two months. And then you can see how it goes, all right? It is a general situation. It could be, I don't know, a gym membership. But something that you will have to pay up front for a year membership or for the whole year and if you think this general situation that you're trying to commit or you wanted to join or you wanted to have if you feel like it's going to change then accept only up until the next two months and keep rolling okay and then the last reading is you've got the empress card the king of swords and the moon hmm you have an ex, you have an ex and uh, you had a very messy breakup, not so good. You're not friends with this ex. They're going to message you. Um, they're going to message you online. The moon card, they're confusing you actually, they're confused. You know, there is an ex who will come forward. I think they are heartbroken or they're looking for a rebound. So watch what you share and watch what you give. I honestly feel like I'm really getting the word disengage. Because they will just mess up on you or confuse you. Okay? Because they're connecting with you. You're connecting with them and you're asking them quality question. They initiated it, you know, like they said to you, hi, Taurus, how's things? And then you reply and you really, you know, updated them with, you know, some important and happy, you know, happy, happy update. You gave them a happy update and they replied with being stern or plain or casual. And you kind of feel like, what is this? Because they're the one who... 
yeah, there's a feeling of they could just be bored or you feel a bit confused because you're being you're giving them a happy update and their respond back is really not quality. So don't give too much effort or don't be so much creative on your question or your answer if this person is is feeling like disengaged when when i say disengaged yes they're calling you or texting you or they're messaging you but there's no quality in the message okay so yeah careful on who you give your energy because some people are just bored that's what i'm getting from this ex okay so this is you thank you so much for tuning in thanks for being here today i hope you like the reading if you do don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell and I'll see you soon again, guys. Bye-bye.